Ovo. Yeah. My favorite student. My oh, favorite circular student. I'll say that. Oh. I have many favorite. All my students are my favorite. Of course, yeah. All my <laughs> my favorite piss baby student. There you go. There you go. All right. How are you feeling, dude? Um, I'm feeling all right. I think, uh, in terms of melee, I think I'm just having like um, I have a good idea of what I'm like supposed to do, mm -hmm. but then just struggling to execute and like exactly position exactly where I need to be. Or, you know, just, like, stuff, decision-making and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. No, I completely agree. Um, I th And I think part of it is, like, the way you're practicing. Sure. I, I mentioned this before. Because I saw you practicing stuff or, like, just warming up before you play someone. And you were doing, like, very specific things over and yeah. over and over again. Which I don't think is yeah. bad. But, like, it's not going to help you in a, in a the scramble moment. situation. Or, yeah, when you're fighting someone where you're not going to see that position, like, 99% of the time. Right. So I'm going to, I'm basically going to try and like show you what, how you should be practicing or what you should be practicing. So it's more chaotic. Um, mm -hmm. yeah, I'm these off. So it's more chaotic and it's more free form. I, I guess, and I know this sounds silly. I want you to think of it like you're dancing. Okay. You know, it's, <laughs> it's not like, like you're going to like, you're going to do some like stuff that's like, Okay, like you do like the steps and the dance, you know, it's like very like one, two, three, and you've done the dance and you just repeat. You're gonna sure. definitely practice that. But I want you to like allow yourself like I think the peak practice or the, the optimal practice for you is is just thirty minutes of doing this. Like okay. you, you can do more if you want, especially the freeform stuff. You can do as much of the freeform stuff as you want. But I think everything else should be limited to at most thirty minutes. Cause I you said you were you were practicing a lot. I think you're, you yeah. Might, I mean, need, I was yeah. yeah, I was practicing a lot like before. Lately, it hasn't been as much, but like, mm -hmm. yeah, I would. It would be ridiculous amounts like during class. Uh, yeah. yeah, and I think I think that's 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 good. Um, but I I'm just gonna try and show you a better way to practice. Um, sure. So let's go into event match. I you you have this. You have version three point Yeah. Okay. Good. Because uh, I want you to go into the two things we're going to use are training lab and uh, L cancel training. So training lab, I'm going to really like. Um, really could use L cancel training for this too, but let's just get a fox. Um, I want you to use battlefield. I don't want you to use FD. I you can use like other triplats if you want, but battlefield sure. is probably just going to be the the best one. Okay. And you so here so. The, I guess like for the first five minutes of your practice, uh, I just want you to practice this, and I, I want you, I, I legit want you to look as good as how I'm doing it. Okay. And I'm not, I'm not gonna like, like I want you to be able to do like this. Mhm. Mm and just like for like, I'd say like just like two minutes of doing this, and it might seem boring at first, and I'm not. That's why I'm only putting two minutes. And I'm not gonna actually do like a full two minutes here, but it's like wave dashing, like dashing. I'm so what I'm doing is I'm dashing and I'm wave dashing out of it. Right. And this is gonna be really good. Out of like, and this is just an example. I don't, I don't need you to do exactly what I'm doing in your practice. Um, it's kind of like that thing I taught, I taught Flexer, like wave dashing to where they tech. Mm-hmm. Um, and I'm not expecting you to do that right now, but, um, that's just, like, an example. Um, but yeah. So, that, that's why this is gonna be helpful, for situations like that. And just for allowing you to be more freeform. Right. And then maybe, like, you do this for a minute, actually, not even two, you just do this for a minute, and then you start adding a shield. Okay. And instead of, like, you obviously can't dash out of your shield, then you just start wave dashing out. Wave dash, dash, shield. Wave dash, well, here, yeah. Shield, wave dash, dash, shield. Wave dash, dash, shield. And uh, then you, like, make that faster. Oh. And it seems, All like, right. kind of complicated, and you're going to mess up a lot when you do it. Like, see, I'm even messing up a little bit. 
since I'm like mm -hmm. kind of doing it over and over again. But like, that's, that's totally fine. Don't get frustrated if you mess up. Like, that's what this practice is for. And if you watch, I, mean, I, you, I know you watch PPMP. You know he like yeah, starts yeah. out, I'm, I'm pretty sure he probably starts out every stream that he's like gonna play. Or at least he used to, uh, just like doing mm -hmm. basic movements. Like he would like just like literally like dash dance on like flats. Mm -hmm. And then like wave dash out and like practice his wave dash lengths. He is like the king of like super basic practicing. He would like do Falco lasers like at different heights. And it looks so fucking boring to me, man. I can't practice as hard as that guy does. <laughs> um, but it does, it is very helpful. But yeah, right. like, you can like mix it in and then like, and then after like you do a minute of like the shield wave dashes, then like start mixing in like this, where you're like, I'm just gonna start dash dancing and then wave dashing out randomly. And like mm, extending my yeah. dash dance. And then sometimes I'll shield and then go back into it. And we're gonna I'm gonna use part of this lesson to actually I want you to practice doing this a little bit on stream. Um but yeah, we're All okay. right. so yeah, that, that that's what that's what I want the first basically ten minutes is you basically like doing this kind of movement. With like the first minute, maybe two minutes, just like dash, wave dash, dash, wave dash, dash, wave dash. Then the next two minutes, uh, shield, wave dash out, dash, shield, wave dash out, dash, and then like making it faster. Yeah. And maybe just like wave dashing out, shield is also fine. That's how you want to start. Mm -hmm. uh, and then the next six minutes, just like mixing it all in, getting creative. It's kind of like fucking around. You don't have to have a huge intention behind this right now, but it'll help. And that's like okay. the first 10 minutes. Then I want you to start placing stuff. So one thing that you need to specifically work on is, is up tilts and like making sure you get an up yeah. tilt come out that isn't up here. Because this, there definitely is a time for this, but it's, it has to be very intentional. Um, sure. But up tilts are gonna be so important. So you can like wave dash in, up tilt. Mm-hmm. Like you could just do this. You know how to reset, right? Yeah. Cool. And like, just practice this. And I, I would do that for like a few minutes, two minutes, three minutes. Obviously you can mess around with these, how long you're practicing certain things. You can do it longer if you're struggling with them. Please go ahead and do it longer if you're struggling with them. Um, yeah. Then. Uh, then you can like start moving around and doing the same thing. So I'm like, I'm, I'm dash dancing. I'm doing that free form movement that I said, but I'm mm -hmm. going to end up, my goal is I'm just going to do this for a while, like maybe a few seconds. And then I'm like, you know what? I'm going to go and up tilt him. And how do I do that? I have to end with a wave dash up tilt. So I'm like doing this, doing this. Oh wait, yeah, See, yeah. I, I messed up and that's fine. I just reset. I messed up, it's fine. You got a thing. Yeah. And then I'm like, do this. Add some shields in there. And that's not only going to just help you, like, get the input of up tilt down, it's also going to help you with placements. It's like, this, like, these are like, it's hard not to tip her uh, on this kind of platform, but, um, mm -hmm. they'll just, like, help you place them. And you can, you can do it at different angles or different directions. Like, if you up tilt this way, obviously going to get sent a different direction if you up tilt facing the other way. So yeah. you know I just mess around with that. It's like I wanna up till facing off the stage. I wanna up tilt facing away from the stage. So that means to do that, and this is this is a little more complicated, I have to face I have to be dash dancing away from our uh, Fox. So like I'm like dash dancing away, then wave dash in up tilt. Oh. That's why wave dashing is really good, because you keep a direction so like I'm still facing right, but I'm wave dashing away. That's like one of the biggest reasons why wave dashing is so good, especially for yeah. Because you can do this aerial, you can do this up tilt. That's so good, like that. And then you can like I, I could have if, if he was at a little higher percent, I could have downed with that in reaction. Like once you get like uh, a lot better, right? And then like yeah, but yeah. Uh, but yeah, the biggest thing I just want you to think about, you don't even have to worry about the direction right now, is just like doing these moves out of this movement, out of this like free form movement that you feel happy with. Right. And then uh, you can even like work on doing fairs. 
like, like trying to get tip repairs. And you don't have to reset every time like I'm doing. You can like just like fuck around and do this. Yeah. I'm gonna do like running down tilt. Just what I want to. Um, yeah, and then like the next the next 10 to 15 minutes or how much time you have left, just like fuck around and like do these aerials or like running down tilt or like any moves that you can do. You can even be like wave dash forward forward smash. Between wave dash grabs. Like just stuff like that. You can just like fuck around and do that. I just want you to do moves and just place them, but I don't want you doing the same thing over again like this. Like I don't want you faring from this um, specific place every single time. Right. Because, like, I think you do, like, I'm, I think I'm, like, over, I'm exaggerating this a bit, but you do, like, something similar to this, where you're like, okay, like, this person's right here, I'm gonna fare them. And I'm gonna practice yeah. up tilting them in this scenario every time. Or, like, I'm gonna, like, do this where I walk in, um, I'm gonna position myself, I'm gonna take my time, like, up tilt. And that's, like, it's not gonna be very helpful, because you're not gonna have that time in a game. In a game, you're right. gonna be moving, hopefully, soon, move more like this. Where you're just dash dancing, right. you're moving around. Even if it's a dash dance like this, um, you're still gonna be moving around. And then you're gonna get, just by doing this, you're gonna get more used to placing your aerials where they're hitting in like the perfect spot, or in at least a better position. Mm -hmm. So I'm just kind of like fucking around here. Blah, blah. Now I want you to try. So we're gonna play a game together. Oh, and I'm gonna oh, be the, the thing you're hitting. I am the punching guy. Okay. So, here, drop your code in chat. Oh, wait, wait. You've been watching stream. I, I did not been Discord streaming. That's my bad. Oh, yeah, no, that's all right. Cool. Um, uh, it's 640. Yeah, we'll 640. Choose your character. Peach. I'll be Fox, I guess. Fox. What's yours? Uh, over 154. Cool. Yeah, man, Melody, just uh, send me send me some uh, Marth set, and I'll be able to coach you next week. You just gotta send me those those things. They call me Willy Punching Bag. Oh, that's what the P stands for. That's what the P stands for, man. That was me in high school. I, I did I tell you I, I actually got shoved into a locker one time in middle school. Oh. And it wasn't <laughs> like those full size lockers. It was a half locker, dude. <laughs> oh. Okay. Are you searching? I'm getting this air. Yeah. Yeah, they, this has been happening a lot. Fizzy even noticed it too. Okay, cool. Oh, yeah. So we're gonna go to Pokemon. Uh, I mean, not Battlefield, so. Battlefield, oh, yeah. Now, I just want you to practice the, the, the basic move the dash, wave dash, forward. So, first we start very basic, right? Yeah, just dash, wave dash. Yeah, exactly like that. We're gonna do that for a couple minutes. You can tell me about your day if you want. Uh, I mean, I woke up like an hour ago. Mm -hmm. So, <laughs> tell, I mean, tell me about your weekend, man. What's been going on? I just want you to talk while you're practicing so you can like get used to doing it more muscle memory wise. Oh, okay, okay. That's the, that's um, the hidden art. Yeah, I'm talking, I'm talking. I don't know, I'm probably just gonna make up just like making up bullshit. But that's streaming, isn't it? Yeah, that is. But like, uh, tell me, tell me though, what are you, what are you, uh, are you, yeah. are you working with music lately? What, what, what's uh, exciting happening in your life in the future or has recently happened? Tell um, me, I want to know all about you, Oval. <laughs> this is an interview now. Interview. Yeah, uh, I'm interviewing you. Okay, see if you're okay. still eligible for that Willie Academy um scholarship. Scholarship, yeah. Right. Um. Well, I'm trying to produce. Well, actually, I got a couple of gigs for the summer, like two days ago or something like okay. someone reached out from like a mall like an outdoor mall near where i live they're like oh we need like duos and, and shit to like come and play like just outside for like their art mm -hmm. thing that they do on thursdays during the summer and i was like oh yeah okay um and kind of reached out so i got two gigs instead of one it was like oh i can do multiple genres so that's awesome um, and okay, producing... now I want you to start yeah. using yeah. shield, wave dashing out of shield. Oh boy! And you can you can just oh. do you can just do shield, wave dash out, shield, wave dash out. You don't have to worry about the dash right now if you don't want to. Okay, I find it hard to like, I don't know, like to not roll, 
And that's what practice is for. So here, when I'm when I'm wave dashing out a shield, yeah, it sounds yeah. like you might be pushing a direction while you're holding shield. So when I'm like when I'm wave dashing out a shield, I'm not. Are, are you holding any of the buttons when you're wave dashing? Are you holding the triggers? Um. Like, are you holding no, anything, the whole just, time? I'm just holding a direction. So you're just tapping L, right? Not when you're yeah. shielding, but when you're doing the wave dash. Yeah, I mean, I use R, but yeah. Okay, then yeah, yeah. I mean, that's what I used to, my bad. Uh, so I, sh I, I, I don't know if you, do you shield with R or do you shield with L? I shield with, I try and shield with L. Yeah, that's what I do. And I think it's easier once you get it down. So yeah, I, I like go of shield as soon as I'm wave dashing. And I think that might help you. Basically, as soon as I press jump, I'm letting go of shield. Yeah, a lot of times I just end up getting a, like a, um, it's like, not directional air dodge. So, here, I'm not sure if you can see the stream. I'm gonna try and show you what I'm doing. This is gonna be kinda hard. So I'm kinda like, <laughs> Man cam. Holding this, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna, so I'm gonna dash dance, hold shield. I let, I, I usually let go of um my joystick when I'm in shield. Okay. So I'm shielding. Oh. You see what I'm doing? Yeah. I'm kind of letting go of the shield as soon as I'm inputting the other input. It's like <laughs> hand reveal. Hey guys. Um, oh shit, my, my camera's right here. Actually, yeah, let me sit right here. Um, so I'm kind of, it's, it's kind of hard to, it's really hard to show like how you're supposed to do this, I guess, because it's all so fast. Um, yeah. But I never like, I think what you're trying to do is you're trying to, okay, you can hit me. I can tell, yeah. Um, I think you're like, you're, I don't, I don't know what you're doing that's, I think you're you're pressing yeah you have to be pressing left or right um, before you're actually inputting the jump. Yeah, that that has to be it. What you're doing. That's the only way I got that roll. Oh yeah, because that's, that's how I, Yeah, I guess because that's how I like wave dash normally when I'm like dash dancing. I already have like the direction in like inputted. Yeah, and that that's a habit you like. I'm not saying you have to. Like, you can definitely do that sometimes, but like in shield, I think you should just get used to letting go of any direction, at least for now, and then wave dashing out. And I think that's something you can practice. Um, so let's stop, let's stop doing that for now. But I think sure. that you, you did you did learn what you need to work on because wave dash out of shield is super important. Um, and so now let's try just, we don't have to worry about shield, but just like dash dance, wave dash out of it. And then start like placing like either an up tilt or like aerials on me. Okay. No worries. Okay. And, and remember, you can't just go at me. You have to be doing the random movement yeah. and then like ending near me. And it's gonna, yeah, it's gonna be a little difficult okay. first. It's definitely a little like harder to do a wave dash and up tilt than some other inputs. So don't worry if you mess up. Yeah. It's such a tiny window mm -hmm. for up tilt. And you can like you can like barely like I'm barely moving this this trigger up. It, it feels like I'm like barely touching it. Uh. And see, that's what I don't want you to do. I don't want you to like wave dash in and see like is this like am I, is this up tilt gonna hit? And then hit. I just want you to swing as soon as you start wave dashing with the up tilt. And it's gonna take some time. Uh, yeah.
So I see you jumping a lot. Is that you trying to wave dash? Uh, yeah, yeah, usually. Mm -hmm. Usually that's just me missing it. Uh, so wave on. Man. So it might help then um, to really get our wave dashes down. So here, let me, um, I'm, we're gonna go back, I'm just gonna go Marth. I'm just gonna see how you're wave dashing. So let's just go back to the dashing and wave dashing. Let's not worry about shield, let's not worry about aerial, it's just right now. So, go. Oh. Yeah. I... So I think I, maybe geez. okay. Let, then let's go back. So this is this is why the beginning the PP and D practice that he does, where he just does basic movement, is really important. Uh, so maybe we need to spend more time on that. Um, so let's just like wave dash across the stage, and like I want you to do it at that rhythm. You're really good at dash dancing right now. So it, it looks like you're good at dash dance. I mean, not dashing, it's wave dashing uh, when it's just by itself. So I think the thing that you do need to learn, uh, do need to work on the most is just this, like dash dancing into wave dash. Here. This is like something I'm doing. I'm like one, two, three, four, five. 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 But you also like I'm making it kind of like the same over and over again, and that's like good to start out with. But then eventually you do want to just mix it up, so you can like wave dash whenever. Because you can wave dash any time during a dash dance. You don't need to be like at the end of your dash dance to wave dash. It can be at the very beginning. So just keep that in mind. And you can also try this thing where you just go back and forth again, but now you have a dash in between. That might be helpful. running down still, or, or just, now you can just like do moves in, in, in this wave dash, yeah. So like I'm, da I'm wave dashing, I'm dashing, and then I'm like gonna run and do a running down tilt. And I think you know how to do that, right? Yeah. Yeah. So this is like, it's definitely a hard part to get over, I, I think for you, but um, you will need to get the movement down for the other things to make sense. Because right now it's like, you, you, I think you know what you want to do in neutral, you just are having a really hard time doing it. Or you're like trying to position yourself well, but you don't have enough time because your movement uh, is slow right now. So I think this is like the next big problem you have to, to face. where you're not even thinking about what you're doing. You're just like, okay, I'm just, like, honestly, I want you to be able to autopilot like this. That, that is, like, yeah. the goal. Between now and the next lesson. Yeah. And it's really fun, because, like, eventually you're like, oh, like, messing with wave dash, you're like, oh, what if I wave dash back and then jump? Oh, I'm going backwards. That's cool. Like, if I jump as oh. I'm wave dashing back, isn't that kind of cool? And then you can, like, do cool things like, oh, I'm going to, like, nair as I'm going backwards. And it's like a, 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 a fading nair. It's, like, really cool. That's why I love Marth. Because, like, moving with Marth is just fun in itself. You can experiment. I just, like, want you to... It's, like, imagine, like, you're writing music and you're just, like, playing a new instrument. 
me just yeah. discovering like, oh shit, like this is a new chord I can play. I didn't even realize. Like just like running down tilt a chord, fade back in there after wave dash is a chord, wave dash forward, down tilt is a chord, wave dash up tilt is a chord. I don't know, like just, I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm even putting too much action on making everything music, but. Sure. <laughs> you get what I'm saying. And do you have fun moving around like this? It's yeah, good, you know. I mean, like, it's it's good. It, it feels good to, like, be able to, like, totally control the character. Mm -hmm. Like, have it go where I want. But it's like, I'm not there yet, right? So. Yeah, so you're still going to struggle. But it, it's, like, it's like anything else you practice. If you just practice this, and I, I don't need to over-practice. If anything, like, practice the free form the most. I'd say, like, probably, like, the simple stuff. Like, wave dash. Dash, wave dash, oh. and um, even shield, wave dash, and probably the last. These are so yeah. Those are four things I want you to practice. And I'm gonna I'm gonna DM them to you so you have a, a written down list. Um, so basics to practice. Fifteen minutes. Wave dash from side stage to side stage, uh, from ledge to ledge. Uh, in here. Um, wave dash into dash into wave dash into etc. Into dash, etc. etc. Okay. And then the other thing wave dash into up tilt. I think just practicing that over and over again over and over is, is, is going to be useful. Wave, uh, sh uh yeah, shield. Wave, wave dash into shield, into wave dash. And then Free form, 15 to 30 minutes. Up to you. Free dashing, dashing into wave dash, into whatever. Really just move, place hitboxes, um, have fun. Cool. So I just DM'd yeah. you all that. Um, yep. So if you ever just want to practice, just practice those kind of things. I think that's going to be the most helpful. Uh, but I do think it's about to be Marge's turn. So, yeah. Do you have Marge. any questions? Um, no, I think, yeah, I think I just need some, like, kind of direction on what exactly to practice, how I can get that execution. Yeah. Have you heard the banger that is chug jug with you? I have not, Marge. But no, yeah, I think that's the that's some basic direction right now. Um, I you have a written down list of what you can practice in like 15 minutes, and that, that yeah. way it's also just like not like I'm practicing over and over and over again because that just gets boring. And if anything, yeah. I know you say you like practicing during classes. I think that's good. If you're gonna practice in class, just do freeform shit. Don't try right. and do the other shit, the more specific shit. Just do freeform shit because that that's the stuff I want you to be able to autopilot. Just fucking oh, okay. going anywhere. The freeform shit is what you need to be autopiloting. The other stuff, that's when you need to be thinking, okay, I'm going to place this up tilt. I need to work on that because I know I can't, f I'm, I'm, I'm having trouble doing it execution wise. But the freeform, you just like fucking go to town. I, 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 I still just love moving around with Marge. It's, mm -hmm. it's fun. But yeah. Marge, get in, get in Discord. See ya. See you, man.